Good Wednesday morning. The time now is 447 and we're looking at our Chicopee live camera right now. Uh, while it's early and very dark, it isn't going to be a clear day. And going to our Springfield live camera, we can see, again, not too visible right now, but it is very clear outside. Great precursor to the rest of the day today. Here's the weather story for today, tomorrow, and the rest of the week. Sunny and dry today, just like we saw yesterday. Rain returns tomorrow in the p.m., though, and unfortunately, it's going to stick around until th the end of Saturday as well. So we got to soak up the good weather today while we can. Our 22 News Storm Team ESP live Doppler radar showing us it's going to be a clear day. No rain today. Today, thankfully, these green spots over here in Berkshire County and a little east of us are not going to be bringing any rain today, thankfully. And our clouds and radar is going to show us why. We would normally get these storms coming from upstate New York, but it seems as if the clouds are traveling a little more south and not as much east coming into Massachusetts, thankfully giving us a very clear rest of the day. Our wind speeds right now, again, a calm wind outside, not going to be blowing anything over, not even your trash can. Looking at our dew points, a very very dry day, not going to be humid at all. We're looking low 50s, even 49 in Westfield, 47 in Orange and going to Berkshire County, a lot of the same, 47 in Pittsfield, 48 in North Adams. And it, honestly, it's not too different from our temperature map right now. Temperatures right now are sitting in the low to mid 50s, 50 in Orange and in Springfield, Berkshire County, a lot of the same, 51 in Pittsfield and 50 in Great Barrington. Our temperatures today are going to go up a bit though. We can see we don't reach the 70s until more towards the afternoon. We're, we're only reaching the mid 60s as we get closer to 12. And then once we get into the afternoon, We'll start to get in the mid 70s, but nothing too much higher than 76 to 78 today. And looking at our sky cast, showing you where and when the weather is going to be, we're going to see that we're again going to have a very clear day, not a lot of cloud cover as well. So it's going to be nice and sunny going through 6 p.m. on Wednesday to 12 a.m. on Thursday. A wonderful Wednesday evening. I know most people don't have the day off, but if you can go outside, I would recommend it. Thursday, that's the day. That is the day of reckoning, unfortunately. We can see that we have a bit of cloud cover. It's only around 12 p.m. once we start to see the effects of these storms coming in. We can see 5 p.m. around Berkshire County. They're going to start moving eastward throughout Massachusetts. And then around 8 p.m., that's when the brunt of the rain starts to show up. We can see just over the state line in New York, these this rain is going to be traveling eastward, coming a little closer to uh, Hamden County, Hampshire County, and Franklin County, closer to around 8, 9 p.m. But as the night goes on, the rain should start to calm down a bit. But we can expect some spot showers throughout the night going into Friday morning as well. Our forecast for tonight is going to be between 54 and 58. Out. Still a very cool summer night, a lot cooler than we're used to, and mostly clear conditions. Now, a look at the 22 New Storm Team 7-day forecast. We got all this rain right here. It stops for a bit on Sunday and Monday. And then we go a little further into next week and we start seeing it pop up again. Tomorrow we're getting those scattered, scattered PM showers and the high drops to 73 and drops up again on Friday to 72 when we're mainly seeing those morning showers. Saturday is not going to be as bad. The temperature goes up and the rain chances go down a bit. We should still see an isolated shower or two. Sunday and Monday are the, are the days where it's going to be the most clear throughout the next seven days. Highs of 77 on both those days. Similar high on Tuesday, but the rain does return going throughout Wednesday as well. Our highs are, excuse me, our lows are looking in the high 50s and the low 60s throughout the week. But if you want to keep track of these rain chances coming this weekend and all your local weather, check out our website, wwlp.com or the free 22 News mobile app.